Hey folks, welcome back to another video of Trailhead Explanations. In this video, we are going to cover unit extend your reporting strategy with App Exchange from the module reports and dashboards for lightning experience. I have covered the previous units of this module. This is the last unit. In order to check out the previous unit solution, you can go and check it out on our solution. So for this unit, basically we have to uh, create a dashboard, my accounts and contact dashboard, which will be a clone copy of my uh, one con account contact and opportunity data quality. And this dashboard uh, will be present only when we install this package from app exchange. So this is the package and we have been provided over here, the ID of this package. So simply I will be uh, launching my trailhead playground. And before we move further, make sure you have you are using the same playground which we created for the second unit. So you need to use the new trailhead playground that you created for this module. So in the second unit, it was mentioned that we have to create a brand new trailhead playground. So we will be using the, that playground only for this uh, challenge as well. So launching your trailhead playground, you will land on this uh, starter page. And uh, here you will find three tabs. Click on this install a package tab over here. And simply you have to provide the ID package ID, which is mentioned over here uh, in the text area. So simply copy this ID and go back to your starter page and paste this package ID on this in this text area. Click on install button. So now it will ask you certain permission that for which users you want to uh, make this app available. So it is mentioned over here that we have to install this for all users. So I will be going uh, back to this uh, page and I, this will remain same. You do not have to, okay. It is mentioned for install for all users. So we have, we will need to change this. So install for all users, select this option and click on this install button. So uh, this will start installing uh, this package for us. It might take some time. So let's just wait for this uh, to install this package. There you go. This package should be installed in our org. Yeah. So installation is complete. Click on this done button. Now, uh, so after installation of this package, we have to go to our dashboard and you will find a dashboard by this name. So let me just go back to the app launcher page and here in the app launcher type dashboards and you will get this option over here. Click on this option. Now, if I'll go to all dashboards, you will find that one account contact and opportunity data quality. This is the dashboard that we have to make a copy for uh, of. Uh, so I will be going far right and okay. Let me just open this up. And click on this edit button. On far top, you can see an edit button. So click on this edit. Now here you will find a drop down just next uh, to your save button. So click on this drop down icon and select save as option. Now here we have to provide the name which has been mentioned in our challenge. So we are simply making a copy of a dashboard which has been uh, installed through a package. So remove this name and paste this name over here. Now, uh, everything will remain same as nothing much is mentioned over here. So simply just go back to the dashboard and click on create button. Now this will create a dashboard for us by the same name, which has been mentioned in our challenge. So as you can see that uh, the name has been changed here. Now uh, we have to edit this and we have to provide some filters. So click on this filter button. And if you see in this challenge that field billing city and display uh, field billing city, which has display name same as that of the field name, we have to select the value as San Francisco. So I will copy this uh, San Francisco uh, value and going back to my dashboard, I will be selecting billing city over here. Display name is billing city and we have to click on this add filter value button and it should be equal to San Francisco, which I have provided. Uh, and which I've pasted over here simply. Click on apply button and simply click on add button. So this filter has been added. Now next what we have to do is we have to simply save the dashboard. So I will go back to the dashboard and click on save button. 
And the dashboard has been saved. Go back to your challenge. And I'll just simply click on this check challenge button. Let's just wait for it to test all the use cases. There you go. This unit as well as this module has been completed. See you in the next video with another unit. Till then, take care. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Thank you.